Sometimes your portraits might have uh, some shadows on the face, uh, and here's a quick and easy way to lighten up shadows on the face, whether it be kind of in the eye area or anywhere on the portrait photo. So go ahead and open up lightning shadows.jpg. First thing we want to do is control J on the PC or command J on the Mac. That duplicates the layer. If you don't see the layers panel again, just go to window, then layers. And we want to adjust this layer blending mode here, how this top layer blends with the bottom layer. Let's go ahead and change that to screen, which will lighten it a little bit. And we don't want to lighten the entire photo, just certain areas where there might be a shadow. Uh, it's going to look a little bit fake at first, but then we'll fix that. I'll show you how. So we want to add a mask and fill it with black. So we could add a mask and then press Alt, Backspace, or Option Delete if we want to fill it with black. But a shortcut, again, is hold down Alt on the PC or Option on the Mac, and then press Add Layer Mask. And that will add a mask, but it will add black to the entire thing. So we're masking out this entire top layer already. We want to paint white in it in the, some areas for it to show through from the bottom layer. So that screening effect will only apply really where we paint because then both layers will be visible in those areas. So make sure your foreground color is set to white and choose a nice soft edge brush. Make sure hardness is set to 0% for this and choose the brush tool and we're going to just click and I'm going to press left bracket here to resize it on while we're brushing. Um, click and drag. And this looks fake at first, don't worry. Looks like he kind of went to the beach, got a suntan, and was wearing goggles or something. So if you just want some areas lightened up a little bit, that's uh, the first step. But then I'm going to show you how to fix this kind of look here. Up where it says opacity, you bring that down, like way down to about 50% or so. All right, so it's a subtle effect. Uh, there's the before, just a couple shadows underneath the eyebrow area, and then there's after. So it just lightens up, quick and simple trick to lighten shadow areas on the face.